We care about neural networks because they've been improving artificial intelligence significantly. They've been leading the way because they can comprehend a lot more data than traditional methods can. Um, with neural networks, you can just add more and more data and make the networks bigger and bigger, and um, the, the real-world performance improves consistently. The problem with deploying deep neural networks is that they require a lot of computation. And th this is different than traditional data center applications. We solve the problem of computation by adding GPUs to our servers. It's uncommon to put GPUs in data center, and that's because GPUs are throughput-oriented processors, which means they need a lot of work to keep them busy. In, in traditional web applications, uh, the, the amount of compute being done on each request is, is pretty small, and that's, that's not sufficient to properly utilize a GPU. In fact, even the process of evaluating a neural network response for, for a single user at a time really underutilizes the potential of a GPU. Fortunately, neural network models tend to be the same for different users and can therefore be shared between multiple requests. This process is known as batching, which is common at training time, but less common in production. When we batch, we essentially turn a matrix vector multiplication into a matrix matrix multiplication. Uh, and that allows us to use caches and SIMD instructions much more effectively. Batching user requests together is difficult because of latency constraints. Users expect that when they speak to their phone, they get a response almost immediately. However, with a throughput-oriented processor like a GPU, you get better utilization by waiting and, and combining a lot of user requests. Uh, we've found that we can still strike a balance between these two and get low latency throughput while at the same time keeping the GPU pretty busy. The technologies we've been talking about today will bring deep neural networks closer to users and that'll in turn help them find what they're looking for. Mm -hmm.